It may be cold and dark this night, with doors and windows locked up tight, and cats and foxes on the prowl, watched over by a silent owl. But Latchy's home all warm and snug, sipping hot chocolate from her favourite mug, while Fordy and Lottie say farewell and wish they had a magic spell, or TARDIS or transporter, something neat, to whisk them from latchies and spare them wet feet. Hot chocolate all done, latchie cleans her teeth, fluffs up her duvet and crawls underneath. Turns off the light and thinks of her pals, her chosen family and animals. She drifts to sleep with a smile on her face, her body cosy, her mind in space, floating free in search of dreams, where nothing is ordinary or quite what it seems. Bits of today mix with old memories, sometimes unusual, sometimes a wheeze. It's how brains remember, make sense of it all, file feelings and knowledge, facts big and small, even while sleeping, Latchy has friends, which is just as well when you hear how this ends. Enter the Snow Queen, tall and bright, a guide for Latchy through the night. You cannot see her through the day, just like stars, it's nature's way. But as with love and the kind of heart, she really stands out when it gets dark. They go together, past the hub, then swirl back round the Cheshire Cheese pub. Instead of humans loud and cheery, Latchy sees dragons getting beery. They belch out fire and singe their wings, so Snow Queen takes Latchy to other things. At Bottler, the creatures that live in the trees are all playing tag with a cloud of bees. In St. Augustine's, pyramids are playing hopscotch on the grids. And Alderman Bolton's enormous playgrounds echo with elephants' trumpeting sounds. Cardinal Newman's riverside fields are full of otters, frogs, and seals basking in moonlight. A latchy grins, takes Snow Queen's hand, and off they spin. Off Kingsway South they spy a hole, a tunnel, what fun, and through they go. Here it's daytime, what a surprise. They blink and squint, adjust their eyes. A beautiful garden, lush and green, with toadstools and flowers, no ice to be seen. The Snow Queen sparkles, despite the light, and suddenly a bird takes flight. It had been painted on the wall, along with creatures big and small, but now it's free to be their friend. A butterfly joins it, oh, and then a caterpillar yawns and sighs. Well, this is a rather nice surprise. Come on, spider, shift your bum, leave your web, let's go have fun. The silky spider nods her head, I'd rather do this than go to bed. Latchy and Snow Queen, joined by new chums, dance out to the darkness, feet pounding like drums. Their music is laughter, the beat is their hearts. Friendship is magic, it gives you new starts.
So many bridges, both high and low, used or abandoned, age starting to show. Some miss the trains, the steam and the clatter. Some have just cars, bikes, people and chatter. Home now to pigeons and lichen and dirt. When Latchy is dreaming, they're on the alert. Trying to keep nightmares and worries at bay. Despite their best efforts, some go astray. But nothing's as bad when you all get together. Whether or not you are birds of a feather. Latchy and Snow Queen, arms open wide, embrace the dream magic, jump up and glide. Pigeons surround them with glittering wings and guide the friends slowly past Thelwall Lane's swings. Past the old tanneries and powder mill, buildings long gone, new houses now built. Filled up with families or people alone, some are quite happy, some weep and groan. Latchy's big wish on this cold winter night is that everyone's happy, with smiles big and bright. For some, this means company or just a grin as they walk down the street or put out the bin. For others, it's cafes or chats in the queue or playing with friends that stops them feeling blue. Everyone's different, and that is so cool, or life would be boring, and dreams would be too. Up the canal there are lights at the locks for greeting the boats and avoiding hard knocks. The warning looks festive and turns the swans pink. The pigeons are puzzled. Why don't they sink? Latchy and Snow Queen alight with their mates and look at the footballs behind the lock gates. Bobbing and tempting, but oh, so far down. Snow Queen shakes her head. You don't want to drown? Even while dreaming, she keeps Latchy safe and gives her advice for when she's awake. The pigeons take flight and flutter away, but Tunnel Bird likes it, deciding to stay. They turn and look upstream, spying a boat, beckon it over, it rises and floats. Not touching the water, it rows through the air and pauses beside them while all the swans stare. In you get, says the Snow Queen, in and sit down. This is the best penny ferry in town. They land in the park and play on the field, hold frozen grass swords and use old leaves for shields. They laugh and they jostle or pretend rugby players, make a ball out of webs with dozens of layers. But something is wrong, or at least it's not right. There's a noise in the trees, birds flutter with fright. The friends stand together, some big and some small. Ballerina is frowning, the trees seem so tall. Something is coming, or some things are creeping, sliding through undergrowth, butterflies weeping. Wherever they look, nothing's to be seen, but that doesn't fool our plucky Snow Queen. She takes a step forward, tells the others, stay back. They shiver with terror and brace for attack. The darkness is moving, the shadows too long. But together they're brave, together they're strong. Their love fuels the Snow Queen. Light shines from her soul and fights off the nightmares who sneak back to their hole. Latchy is delighted, as are the whole crowd. The cries of hooray are incredibly loud. It just goes to show that when you make friends, things that may break you Instead, make you bend and bounce back, recover, start feeling all right. Not just in daytime, even at night. So
so smile at your neighbors. Look out for the lonely. Be proud to be you. You're the one and only.